I have to have the window open because it's like 27 degrees in here, which is too hot for comfort. Well, it seems as though we're being faced with yet another disaster. So this was sitting face down, right about there, which was a mistake. I shouldn't have put it there. I sat down right here. This fell face down somewhere around here on this power supply. I didn't think any of them of it at the time. This would have been about an hour ago. There's a problem here. It's just dead to the world. Trying to turn it on does absolutely nothing. You can see my wonderful reflection in there. Hello, people. Let's also see that my hair is terrible. You can see it. It's just dead. It's... There's... I get nothing out of it. You know what I haven't tried yet? It would be a good idea. We to plug that in. Plug it into the computer. And uh, see what we get. I actually did try pulling the, uh, the uh, sim out, which was a task in and of itself. I don't get anything out of it. And I also get a USB device not recognized error, so... Oh. We have an orange light. Is it working? Obviously not. Come on. Power on, damn it. Okay, so if that's not going to work, let's try plugging it into the wall outlet. Didn't mean to actually stop the camera there, but whatever. There's less editing I have to do. Try plugging this in. The right way to be good. I still get nothing out of it, other than a blinking orange light. So I don't know what that means. It might mean it can't charge. Something else? How about I pull the battery and see what it does? See if we can get it to boot off of just the mains. Or it won't. They call it the mains in, um, whatever. Nope, it's not working at all. I just get a blinking orange light. Well, this is kind of not exactly planned. I was hoping that this was not going to die yet, because phones are not exactly cheap to get a decent one. Plus the plans, you think of like a plan, it's like freaking expensive, man. Especially for a decent plan. Um, sure, I have said that I haven't liked this phone in the past, but that's because it didn't work. Well, it, it worked, but it only worked when it wanted to. But the problem with that is, is, well, obviously it only works when it wants to, which is not good, but when it did work, it worked really amazingly well. Save being slow. But now, of course, it's not working at all. And uh, maybe it'll come back to life in the morning. I'm hoping that it will. Anyway, to say the very least, I am a little bit pissed off about that. For a phrase, I ain't having it. This is... Ugh. I just got this damn thing, too. Not that long ago, either. It is... What is this now? This is probably about maybe pushing a year old right now. So it's brand new, and it already doesn't work. Maybe it's the battery. I don't know. I'm hoping it's the battery. But then again, I don't want to shell out ba money for a battery on a device that I... First of all, I rarely use. Second of all, that is probably not worth anything to anybody. The only thing that's worth to me is working as a cell phone, because I kind of need that. Kind of surprised that it isn't lasting, or it didn't last as long as I had hoped. But then again, I probably should have seen it coming, because it was acting fidgety over the last week. First, it started acting temperamental with text messages, and then it stopped sending them all together. It, can re it could receive them fine, but it can't, couldn't send anything. And then it started freezing randomly, so to the point where you'd have to reboot it. 
and then it started turning itself off randomly, and now it's just dead. Luckily for me, I actually set up an iMessage on this thing, which is upgraded to iOS 6 now for those who did not. I don't think I showed that yet. It is definitely running iOS 6, and I can prove that in just a second. General about blah blah blah. 613, or not. Yeah, 613. And I should check out software updates. I don't think there are any. Anyways, iTunes Wi-Fi Sync, blah blah blah. There are a lot of other features in here that I still have to check out because I've never used any of them. I don't like, I'm gonna give my one criticism here, I don't like the fact that you can't put the newsstand inside another folder. Or at least last I knew you couldn't put it, yeah, you can't put it inside another folder, which is just ridiculous, because you can put everything else inside of another folder, but not that, apparently. It's too important to put in its own little folder. Not to me, I'll never use it, but whatever. Apple always has to uh, advertise their services to you. Yeah, like I was saying, kind of pissed off about that. If it doesn't show, which it probably doesn't because I'm trying to uh, remain calm, because it is about 1.20 in the morning, so... God, I don't want to be yelling because there are people here who are trying to sleep. Namely, everybody but Nick. Achoo! So anyways, thank you for watching. If you have any comments, feel free to leave them down below. Unless they're about the cracked screen, because I won't answer any of those questions. I've already mentioned it before. This is CP666 signing off. I hope to see you next time. Till then. And I really can't see anything right